This video is sponsored by Loot Crate, the monthly subscription service for geek and gamer gear and other pop culture items. Hey guys, on this week's vlog update we've got quite a bit of exciting news. First of all, Eli from Zednot Alpha has actually been staying at my place for the past week, so we have a few collaboration projects on the go which will be ready very soon. Hey, can you do that, uh, but do it better? Also, don't forget to stick around to the end of the video because we have this lovely new end card which gives you more information about our projects, what's coming next, and of course some bloopers and outtakes from our previous videos. Alright, you want to see what we've been working on? Follow me. This is the result of our collaboration with Zednot Alpha. He calls it the Brain Blender, and there will be videos coming out soon on both our channel and Zednot Alpha's channel showing it in action. And let me tell you, it is pretty freaking sweet. We just finished building Reinhardt's Rocket Sledge from the video game Overwatch. Now this thing weighs about 60 pounds, so it's pretty hard to swing, but it can do some serious damage. Here's a quick clip from uh, our test yesterday. Now let's check out some of the packages we got in the mail this week. We ordered some LiPo safe bags because as you know the lithium polymer batteries we're using for the flight project can kind of explode and catch on fire so it's important that we protect ourselves. Also, for a project upcoming we are building a Batman grappling hook gun complete with an ascension device and this is one of the motors we'll be using. Now this is actually a 2.7 kilowatt motor that's almost like 4 horsepower and we'll be using two of these to make the ultimate winch for pulling ourselves up after we shoot the grappling hook gun. So, more on that a bit later. Hobby King has also sent us a few more EDFs. Now, these are the really nice ones. It's an all metal body, so it's a lot more durable than some of the other plastic ones. For a Halloween project we're working on, we picked up, what do they even call this? The Abominable Snowman. Now, this is basically a uh, fuzzy costume but what we're going to be doing is using a CO2 fire extinguisher to be able to blast snow from the costume's wrists. And that's going to be a really fun project for our big Halloween party that we're throwing here at the Inventorium. And, oh, we also have some solder. Finally, we got a loot crate. For less than 20 bucks a month, you get six to eight items that include licensed gear, apparel, collectibles, and unique one-of-a-kind items. You have until the 19th at 9 p.m. Pacific time to subscribe and receive that month's crate. And when the cutoff happens, that's it. It's over. Loot Crate has supported YouTubers since the company shipped its first crates. By supporting Loot Crate, you support my channel, allowing me to do things like this for your entertainment. Sign up at URL to be determined and enter code HACKSMITHS to save 10% off any subscription. Horror. It's October's theme. Channel your best final girl with items from The Walking Dead, Nightmare on Elm Street, Friday the 13th, and Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Some more mail just arrived, and it's some tactical first aid kits meant for uh, attack vests used in airsoft, paintball, and the military. And what we did was we sized these out just right so we can fit four of our lithium polymer batteries in them. So just one of these packs now is enough to power both the arm thrusters. You'll have a second pack for the uh, jet boots and a third pack for the jet pack. So, stay tuned for the next flight update to see how we use those. If you guys want to send us fan mail, we actually have a P.O. box now. So you can use that address to send us fan mail or whatever you want. In addition to the Baja project, we also actually picked up a racing go-kart that still works. So, we're actually doing a bit of work for my neighbor's company, uh, Accelerated Systems uh, Incorporated. And what we'll be doing is doing some baseline tests with the stock engine on here and then replacing it with the same electric motor that was on the other go-kart and seeing how it compares. But it's going to be pretty neat to see those numbers side by side. We were a little set back because we've been doing a whole bunch of collaborations lately, first with Jerry Saval and most recently with Eli from Z Not Alpha, who's still in my house right now actually. Mm, I want to ride the pony. Uh, I think by next week we'll be able to have a flight update for you and we'll be able to test both the boots and the arm thrusters at the same time and see what kind of lift I can get. I'm pretty excited and I hope you guys are too. We're also working right now on converting our inventable CNC router into a CNC plasma cutter which is going to allow us to make more complex parts out of metal uh, a lot easier. Now 
As you'll see in the build of Reinhardt's rocket hammer, we were doing it by hand using laser cut templates to guide the gun along. So once again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on these videos. Your support helps. Don't forget to share with your friends and check us out on Facebook and Instagram as well. Thanks for watching. Test, test, how does it sound? Tacking, tacking. Blah, 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 blah. All right, you want to see what we've been working on? Follow me. Send us fan mail or whatever you want. Please, no anthrax. To protect ourselves from the dangers of Samsung Galaxy 7s.